we are starting our day with a morning swim in Baltic Sea in Dempki. This beach is quite small and it's already getting very busy, but it's a very beautiful beach, I can see why. You can go quite far out and just be standing. There's a guy all the way over there. And <laughs> She's standing. She's just standing. I'm gonna go for the dip. The dip. <laughs> so a lot of this beautiful Polish north coast. I guess it's all like this, isn't it? You have a forest and then you have the beach. Yeah, it looks very similar. Yeah. And so far all of the sand has been so lovely and soft. Very fine and white. <laughs> um, and in this particular place, some kind of like free camping, like there's just caravans and camper vans and loads of stuff. Um, and I don't know, I guess people come here a lot for their holidays. And it's a very popular destination because it's early. I mean, it's not, it's not that late and the beach is already out. It's getting full. <laughs> it's filling up really quickly. As you can see, it's very busy. Cars everywhere. And it's during the week. Yes, but it's still holiday time, so that's why it's so busy. We're gonna have some breakfast now, quick breakfast, probably toast with peanut butter and jam and lovely tea. And then we're gonna head up to the most northern point of Poland, which is called North Star. This is how a real van looks in the morning. Sometimes. Sometimes you're too lazy to do the dishes from, from <laughs> dinner. But the reason why I think is because we just we clean this and we kind of we don't want to get it dirty already. <laughs> yeah, we're trying this out for washing dishes, but we're not really a fan. Um, yeah, so we have some leftover dinner. We have some fresh breakfast. Cup of tea with how many tea bags? Mm, because I thought I would have a tea as well, mm -hmm. but and I put new one as well already. But then I decided I would drink coffee and you ended up with three teas. Wow. <laughs> okay. Re reusable. Yay! The van still has the starting issue. No more glow plug error. But, but it does crank for quite a long time still so injectors maybe so I think that's another job for the list but I think you did injectors already no I didn't you didn't you clean them or something no I put the injector to. cleaner through mm. the fuel filter but didn't help you need to actually take them out and squirt them and check them I guess mm -hmm. There is a field and campers, many, many campers and tents over here. People also leave cars over here to go to the beach. And there is a cycling trail all along this north coast. And this is also a popular place for cyclists to stop and camp. Which means it's gonna be busy at the seaside. Yeah, today is Thursday, so it's only gonna get worse from today. Yeah, and this many cars, I don't know, 
it is just not... since 10 minutes maybe yeah. the side of the road looks just like this because it's free as well yeah it is free crazy oh it's a gap and we have only four minutes to our destination and hopefully we will find some space for our top <laughs> Let's just double check that this one is for free. It is for free. How do you know that? Because <laughs> I just know. Okay. Look, parking. Yes. Best partner. Best partner. Yeah, which means for free. Yeah. Oh, well done. For some reason, Polish people love, just love, adore wind protectors. Every Polish family going to the beach at the Polish seaside. One of the reasons is because the Baltic Sea is quite windy and that is the, the excuse <laughs> but the truth is that maybe because they want to have a private space and they really care about that and they don't like children running around or other people running around and sands, you know, splash in the, in the faces and in the <laughs> eyes yeah, I don't know, they just love wind protectors and no one else in the world you can see as many wind protectors at the beach like in Poland. It's there, it's there. The most northern rock in Poland. Your rock, a place. Well, over there is more northern than here. Just another typical holiday seaside town. You can get some food. I love some junk. You can buy a bunch of souvenirs and spend your hard earned money on your lovely two week holiday. Let's check out the fountain. Wow. Check it out. Check it out. That's an abstraction. Come to Poland to see lovely fountains. our spot is that how you say in Polish? Hell. 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 Welcome to hell. <laughs> Less of us from last night dinner. Because yeah. We don't have really time to cook. Because we're gonna head out to the beach. And we still have quite a walk to, to get there so this is how the days are going sometimes like wake up have a bit of a lion. You drive somewhere, stop, go to the shop maybe, you have some lunch, drive a bit more, and then the day is like, it's five o'clock or something. It's crazy. It just disappears. Like, we don't know where. Yum, yum. Because you can't really park in hell without paying, uh, we're gonna walk the rest. It's about two and a half kilometers. And we just wanna go like to the end of hell, because like, there's a nice beach. It's very windy. At the end of hell. Yes. So, yes. yeah, we're going to have a lovely walk through this forest and then through the town and see some new things. You, have you been here? Yes. I've been here with my family a few years ago, but we cycled here by bikes and it was really fun. It was beautiful. I have not been here before. But you're here. Yes. <laughs> Is she alive? Yeah. This is road. Go back to the forest. Yes. How the beginning of Poland. This is what it looks like in the end of hell. We have lovely beach, lovely water, and lovely 
this hand, the weather is perfect. Surprisingly, it's not actually too windy because normally it's very, very windy here. Just went for a dip and uh, Justina literally was about to walk into a jellyfish. So I guess we're not to... I'm highly disappointed of hell because I wanted to swim. I have high desire of swimming right now and I cannot because there is plenty of jellyfish in the water and we have no idea if they're safe or if they stink there's just few people in the water there's not many but nobody's screaming nobody is crying so i don't know maybe they do not stink we just don't know and we don't want to risk of uh, swimming with jellyfish and get sting because because why do you have oh i have some experience about that i've been stung once before in greece in corfu and it wasn't very pleasant, I must say. <laughs> Apparently this is the most beautiful street in hell. So having a quick walk down it. And then we're kind of racing now against the sunset. There's a very cool swing and like a sunset spot like for pictures, which is near the van. We're gonna go try go there. There's also some live music, which uh, there's some famous, like it was a very famous song and the guy is gonna be performing it, but we're not gonna hang around for it. Because we don't know, yeah, we don't know what time he's singing. Yeah, it's the first act and she's already been on for almost an hour. And I think he's gonna be... Probably the last one. Yeah. This is the biggest star. Yeah, so that's what's going on and we are hoping that in this week there is there's gonna be nobody there because everyone is uh, here mm. so and we got like one shot it is beautiful look because all the flowers oh, very lovely mm. very beautiful this looks like a ship <laughs> <laughs> we're very close and the sun is almost well i don't know if it's down it's pretty dark <sighs> We'll see you get there. I think that was a, a good decision to quickly get out of the town and rush back here because the sunset just is just banging beautiful i don't remember when last time we had such a great sunset actually mm, we've seen quite a few sunsets and this is a good one it's not much it's not much in terms of cloud but just with the water and, and the, the colors the, how the water looks very very nice and beach and swing yeah Mm, it is magic. I love how our van looks like, how Omar upgraded it because I can be now here in the back just by myself. I don't need to move him all around, I don't need to hit his, uh, tell him to move or something. He's just sitting over there on the swivelly chair and it is like I'm just alone in this place right now. <laughs> so I can cook in peace and it is just great. I didn't even think, I didn't even imagine how that will help our daily life actually. How it will like upgrade our daily life mm -hmm. in the van. We're sleeping in this forest. 
there's no other vans here um, there's somebody camping next to the lake but it's pretty quiet pretty creepy no no not creepy it's just very quiet there's no signal yeah now it's it's late and we're we're hungry very hungry so we're gonna do some well when i say we justine is gonna do some kebabs and oh, i'll help you i'll chop some garlic yes. or something you'll be my helper as always <sighs> yeah guess what i'm making medallions When we go to Poland, my mom already made a she had huge stock of our kotlety server <laughs> because that is great. Like you can use this as anything, literally. Oh yeah. Oh dear. No, it's okay. I like toasty. I mean toasty. Again. Gosh. Wow. <laughs> what are we having this? Ten. Ten. Hundred out of ten. Delicious. Mm -mm -mm. That's delicious. You will ask, what are we doing? <coughs> or what exactly Omar is doing? He has a piece of sand on in his eye and we are trying to do first eight cup of water and soaking your eye in the water. Not moving. Try to move your eye, Bob. If you've got any tips, leave them in the comments. <laughs> Is it better? Alright, mission success. I got the thingy out of my eye. I'm not really sure how, but it's out. I'm sure that was my water helped. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> but it wasn't coming out of the water. Anyway, we're going to sleep. Uh, thank you for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. We, we enjoyed hell. Yeah, beautiful sunset. Everything's lovely. And we're going to sleep. Good night. See you next time. Bye. Bye.